Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I hope you are doing great today. In today's video, we're going to look at how to make your pluggable database to stay opened permanently. Now, you would have observed that each time you shut down your database and start it up again, your pluggable database is mounted and not opened. And then you have to manually open the pluggable database again. So if you have to shut down your database 10 times in a day, it means you manually open your pluggable database 10 times in a day. This is not efficient. There must be a way to deal with this situation. Now, starting from release 12.2, Oracle provided a solution for this. And this is what we want to look at in today's lecture. So, as usual, my server is on and then I have my terminal open. So, I'm going to start by connecting to the database. You can see I'm connected to an idle instance. So, if I say start up. Okay, so our database is started, is mounted and is open. Now, I want to check the status of the pluggable database. So I'm going to issue the command select name open underscore mode from v dollar sign PDBS. Now, the next thing I want to try to do is to manually open the pluggable database. OK, so for that, I'll say alter pluggable database OROCLP db open pluggable database has been altered so the next thing i want to do is to execute the command alter pluggable database orocl save state now if you execute this command you will see that the next time you shut down your database and start it up again it will actually be open okay so i'll execute this command and you can see the database has been altered. The pluggable database has been altered. So how do I know? Let me shut down the database, shut down immediate. Now, if I start up the database again, you will see that the pluggable database is also open. So I'll issue the command start up. Okay, so let's issue the command again, select name, comma, open underscore mode from v dollar sign pdbs execute so you can see that orocl pdb is actually open in read write mode okay so this is actually a permanent fix for manually having to start your pluggable database each time you shut down and try to start up again. So I hope this video was interesting to you. If it was, kindly like it and share it widely. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell icon so you don't miss out whenever I upload another valuable content. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye for now.